to the reading for Sagittarius, so I'm really rising. you got the most reviews, so I'll do your you versus them reading first. Yeah, so if you resonate at all, drop me a comment and like and share the video and subscribe if you haven't already. Alright, I'll do it two more times and then we'll go. So it's you versus them, Sag. So it depends on if, if you feel like you resonate with the other side to your own, you know. I'll do you on the left, them on the right, but you can swap it over, is what I'm saying. Um, okay, so Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising. I'll lay the cards out and then we'll go through them. Okay, so we've got the overall energy as the Eight of Swords. So that's like an energy of um, like blindfolding yourself to a truth because that's the overall energy of the reading. So that's between you both. And yeah, it's, uh, it's an energy of like feeling like you have to, well, like you're blindfolding yourself to a truth. And it might be because there's a lot of gossip going on around this at the moment because there's lots of birds around her but that's an illusion in some ways because it's not real because you you're imagining it so maybe you're imagining gossip of things going on that aren't going on such um okay so the overall energy of the reading the relationships energy at the moment is a strength card could be a leo involved but um yeah it's like you're wearing a mask with each other one side's the lamb and one side's the lion so it's like It's almost like there's maybe one of you in this relationship is very fiery and the other one's like kind of like beneath that person and maybe that's not you don't like that maybe it's taking a lot of strength as well to overcome it at the moment maybe <clears throat> maybe one person needs to stand up to the other person i don't know why i get that part <laughs> Right, okay, so your mental state at the moment, Sad, is Eight of Wands. Um, yeah, I feel like it's maybe you or the person on this side, anyway. You need, you want to speak about something. Maybe you want to speak passionately or you want to speak like fiery messages or talk. But you feel like you can't. You feel like you're being blocked, maybe, um, for some reason. Uh, and your person... They've got the two of wands. So your person's made a choice in their mental state about the relationship. They feel like there's a choice been made between two of them. I will clarify this in a minute. Um, okay, so your emotional state Sarge, is the star card. So you feel like you've healed something and you can come back round. There's another chance. There's a light in the sky about the situation. Um, and your person has got the four of cups. Your person's feeling like there's no point coming forward because somebody will get, you know, either you won't want it or or you'll you'll I'll say abandon the person. That's not the right word. Um, you'll say you don't want it. You know, you don't want their love, their cup. Uh, what you have to offer the relationship is a wild card you would like to totally wipe the slate clean and have a new beginning and what this person brings this person of yours could definitely be a leo because it got this fire sign here what they bring is themselves like the fire sign um i mean the king of wands is but the, i normally see the king of wands as aries but in this is a lion in the back so it's like it's a leo got a leo card there as well this person's very strong i feel what they bring you is that they might also be a bit of a player though they might also not be completely faithful to you with that king of wands okay um what you uh fear about the relationship is being single the nine of pentacles you actually fear that you might end up on your own 
and you want that to be addressed yet you it's like you want to be with this person and this person also they believe you're their blessing they've just done something okay <laughs> i don't know why i feel that but i do um okay so what's the strength card so why has sagittarius got that yeah i feel like maybe there's you're needing strength on this and maybe you're the weak side and they're the strong side like there's the lamb on this side and there's a lion on that side maybe there was a fair party there's three people in that card three of cups yeah maybe there was even a, a, an earth sign involved because there's a queen of pentacles maybe it was the mother of their child um and maybe this has put them in hangman so they've not been making decisions they've kind of like been probably giving you half truths maybe or that's the other way around but i'm seeing it on that person's side Okay, so why have we got the Eight of Wands in reverse? Because of the strength card. Because of Aaliyah. Your mental state is you haven't... I don't feel like you've even probably really argued this one out. Uh, yeah. I feel like maybe you had an end of a cycle, maybe. Um, and... You, you're thinking about that a lot, about this relationship, but you've had an end of a cycle with somebody, so someone's come to an end. Or at least that's what you think mentally. Uh, let's clarify the two of wands. Maybe this person's now made a choice, though, between you and somebody else, maybe. Could even have been two people. Yeah, two of wands, clarifying the two of wands. Yeah, they've made a choice mentally, they've chosen between two they've looked at what what they what they could build with someone now they want a relationship okay so why has sagittarius got the um star card i feel like you might need to talk to this person yeah you've got this star card you've had to heal Maybe you've even had to heal with still illusions and lies that have, you haven't actually got the true favour. Um, and maybe you've gone a little bit mad. You've got that queen, king of cups there. Maybe you've had to like guard your, even though you love somebody, you've had to guard your feelings about them. Maybe you've been drinking too much as well. Um, yeah, indecision. Maybe you've been indecisive about this as well because of the juggling. That went on maybe with the two of pentacles there yeah i made you single this is like your emotions on it all so you're feeling yeah because somebody maybe went off and had a new beginning with passion uh why has that just person got the four cups i feel like they feel they can't come back now because they too much has been done yeah, the four of cups clarified by the four of cups, they do. Yeah, they feel like there's too many obstacles that he's got to jump over all them obstacles. Yeah, and that judgment's been made. But they also know you've opened, you've left the door open for them, Sad, so they know that. In their emotions, they know that. Anyway. So why have we got the wild card for what Sad offers? Yeah, I feel like if... I feel like you feel like you're you're ready to make a move. Like you've made um, a judgment. I suppose if this person doesn't come forward, you're gonna, you you're gonna move on. Yeah, and maybe you thought about sending these messages because it was in reverse there. But here, what you have to offer them, maybe you're thinking of messaging them. Maybe to tell them about the star card, the healing, um, and how you would like a new beginning. Maybe that's what you have to offer. Okay, we'll see what this person has to offer. The king of wands. Yeah, this person's still looking at what they've done. They're looking at. They're not looking at you behind them with the two of cups. They're looking at how much has gone wrong. And I almost get like a fuck attitude. Like, well, it's all gone wrong. So what's the point? Yeah, four swords like sleeping on it even though they know you're the two of cups they know that these two cups are sitting here but they feel like with the nine of wands it's like it's it's a lot to get it back 
but you're their lover, you're their person. And they know that they need to come into you, but they're coming in very slowly. Like, very slowly. It'll be real when it gets there, but it's very slow. Yeah, they want to offer you this Ace of Cups. They want to offer you a new beginning with love. Okay, so we'll clarify. Yeah, they want to leave someone to come towards you. Such Sagittarius, yeah. Send you an apology, Knight of Cups, an apology. To tell you their feelings. Okay, why have we got the Nine of Pentacles, the Sagittarius is fear? Yeah, you don't want to, because of a player energy, you, you don't want to be single. You don't want to carry on being, I feel like you want the same thing too. I think you, you're just scared because of what they did. Yeah, Page of Wands, sending messages, jumping between people. Maybe even a pregnancy that could have been such because that's messages coming in of a pregnancy. Yeah, maybe going off and having a new beginning with stability somewhere else. That's what you were scared. That's what you... What things that need to be addressed, I suppose. Okay, and they've got the Nine of Cups. Yeah, their fear is their blessing walks away with an Eight of Cups. That's walking away, going to find something else. Yeah, being in your head about that. Because they want a higher level of commitment with you. This person doesn't not doesn't want this to be over. This person wants this to um to carry on. Why have I got this horror friend? Yeah, because they think you're their empress, you're their person. This person really does want to come back. <laughs> yeah, then the lovers. Uh, yeah, feeling like five of cups again. This person, and you're both, you're actually manifesting them as well, I feel, even though they've done you wrong. What have we got this manifest, manifesting card? Oh, yeah. Because it was a devil energy. This somebody had addictions. There was things going on. Um, but what you're both manifesting is this Ace of Cups. Why have we got this devil card? Here? Yeah, somebody was somebody was guarded. Somebody had to be guarded in this. I feel like the devil energy. There was like almost like. You could have been manifesting the Ace of Cups or it could have just, yeah, you're feeling like you have to be guarded. That one's, he's being guarded. He's he's standing forward, but he's been for a lot. Yeah, Ten of Cups is what you both want, what you want to manifest. The higher event, higher level of commitment. Um, I feel like you both want the same thing. I feel like it's just... Who's brave enough to come forward? Yeah, judgment has to be made. Has to be your person, I feel. Uh, let's get some get a message from the universe. I feel like it has to be your person come forward and offer judgment and tell you. But I do feel you you love this person too. In every moment, the universe is conspiring to bring me towards the right-minded thinking and the energy of love. Uh, we'll do one of these chakra ones. Ooh. Grief. Yeah, I feel like you've been hurt by this Sagittarius a lot. Yeah. Gratitude. Maybe this person did have a child with somebody else when they went off because there's a baby there. There could have been gossip about this as well. And a completion. There could have been an ending, complete ending between you and this person because of of things you found out, maybe. Oh, and then we got options. Consider the career possibilities you're open to. And then you've got freedom. Maybe you need more freedom. Maybe you've been held back a little bit. 
and then you've got travel maybe you're about to travel Serge practice you need to practice something the best way to get be good at a skill is to practice yeah and we've got to try something new maybe you maybe you need to break free from your everyday mundane things maybe you're getting a bit like you need to do something um because you've got to try something new you'll never know unless you try it maybe he's telling you not to be with this person um, could be that i mean it was guiding you through most of the way but actually maybe you need to do something new uh, love heals fear the power of your love can help bullies and angry people be less afraid right well i oh, will do one of them and then we'll do one of these talent cards so you have to just think of a question quickly and then i'll give you the answer well hopefully give you the answer I'll do two of these yeah teaching maybe you should do some teaching maybe that's something you want to do in your career and you want to do go forward even in you versus in reading maybe you have lots of body work tattoos and stuff or you want to okay so we've got one two three so think of that question and then i'll quickly uh so i'll read these for you yeah so tradition you've got the teacher card which is a chance to start again so maybe in a relationship so tradition and conventional behaviors behavior and the rule of law are important to you and your environment time to be careful to stick to the rules or be sure your sins will find you out. This is a time to take stock and move forward. Check all contracts. And then the next one you got was the emotions card. And the bottom of that is open your heart to a new relationship. Failure of a partnership or breakdown of a relationship, a possible broken heart, loss and feelings of sadness. You have allowed your, your connection to run out of control. Unable unhelpful choices have been made that can that can be redeemed if you address if you address them think positive thoughts and then the last one is the temptation card start today don't put it off confront your fears and they will melt away do not allow fears to stifle your spiritual growth avoid negative and destructive people don't be afraid to seek help from friends or relatives whose morals you admire positive thought only oh wow so I, f I feel like you've been guided not to be this person but there you go i'll leave it there with you sad i hope that's all right lots of love take care bye